This uh, coronavirus vaccine is on the way to Western Washington. 65,000 doses created by Pfizer expected across the state by mid-December. And for the first time in the nine months or so since uh, I took that call, I actually am very optimistic. Though new models released by UW's Institute for Health Metrics and Evaluation predict death rates from COVID-19 rising through the end of April. This despite being on the cusp of a nationwide vaccine distribution. Of all the models predicted, Dr. Chris Murray says the slowest rate of climb will come with universal mask use. That can make a huge difference. So, you know, we've, for, for months we've been pointing out that if we can get everybody to wear a mask or even 95% of people to wear a mask, we can really put the brakes on transmission in, in many places. So between now and about April, uh, you know, if, if everyone listened to President-elect Biden, we could save almost 70,000 lives. As for the vaccine, it will save lives, just not immediately. Experts show it will have little impact on infection rates through January and February. A rollout that's already underway. Cold storage sites, 20 around the state, are ready to receive shipments that could come sometime in the next two weeks. Healthcare workers will be among the first in line to get vaccinated. Really, by the end of December, I think we're, we're all feeling pretty confident that in the state we'll see, uh, you know, the vast majority of our healthcare personnel uh, vaccinated, which is very exciting. Good news for a group that's bore the brunt of this pandemic, a pandemic that's not over yet. In Seattle, Sebastian Robertson, King 5 News.